finding outputs of a two-step function with decimals that models a real-world situation. Function notation. Joe rented a truck for one day. There was a base fee of $11, and there was an additional charge of $0.08 cents for each mile driven. The total cost, C, in dollars, for driving X miles is given by the following function. C of X equals 11 plus 0 0.08X. What is the total rental cost if Joe drove 20 miles? Okay, first we're just going to start off by labeling what we know. So C is the total rental cost. Okay, can you see how it says the total cost C in dollars? That's the C in the equation. And that is what we're looking for. What is the total rental cost if Joe drove 20 miles? <clears throat> now this X is what we need to know. What are we going to put in for X to come up with that total rental cost? So X is in miles. We're driving X miles. And so then in this question at the bottom, what is the total rental cost if Joe drove 20 miles? That is the X number we're going to put in there. So to solve this equation, now we are going to say, okay, I'm looking for C of X when X is 20, right? That's what we decided. We're going to put in for 20. 20 in for x to come up with this total rental cost. So C of 20 is $11 plus 0 0.08. And we're putting that 20 in for x in this equation. See how I just rewrote this equation, but now I have a 20 instead of an x. So let's solve and find out what happens. Okay, so I'm going to type in exactly what this says. 11 plus 0 0.08 times 20. See how that looks just identical? I pressed enter. And I got 12.6. So this is in dollars. So my answer is 12 dollars and 60 cents.